just wanted to say I started out with a, a 18 by 24 inch uh, styrofoam cube and right now I am cutting down the sides for the neck because what I'm trying to do is make at least a torso for the Frankenstein head so at least I'm going to try to get that part done sorry for all the shaking and we'll see where we go from there be back in a bit okay so right now what I'm doing is I'm trying to get the width of his chest at this point and like I said I'm using the foam head I got at Michaels as a guide so I'm trying to check and see if I'm as close to his anatomy as possible on his chest area um, pretty close on the throat area I'm going to pull it down just a tad bit more <coughs> excuse me but you can kind of see where I'm starting to get his shoulders in and his chest area but I still kind of think that might be just a tad bit too wide but I'm not really sure still have to calm down the edges and uh, I'll be back I've got the neck pretty well situated got his chest going on hope I don't knock his head off while I'm turning it but I even think I've got the proportions going on he's kind of blocky which is pretty good but I've got his shoulders coming in his back is a little bit altered so that he has that almost humpback looking to it and yeah I'm kind of happy with him looks pretty good let me back up a little bit looking pretty good so I've got a few more spots I can kind of get going on it but all in all I don't think it's a bad look okay here's the finished torso I've got it pretty much like I want it still have to uh, do the arms and the pelvic area but I think all in all it's pretty cool the head seems to mount pretty steady on it. Let's hope it doesn't fall while I'm doing this. So it looks pretty good. Now onto the arms, torso, and the legs and see what happens. Okay, so now I'm starting on the the hips and the upper thigh and of course the buttocks. I've already got those carved out. They're going to be sanded down. I'm just going to uh, make that edge a little straighter so it'll sit on but I uh, as far as I can tell right now it looks like it is the right size although I kind of got to tell you I kind of like it kind of cattywampus sitting right there and uh, it looks like it's got the good dimensions on it but uh, yeah I'm, I'm kind of happy with it I think next time I record it's going to be a vertical maybe kind of like the crook in his waist so I don't know I may keep that okay see you in a bit okay I think I got his torso his pelvic and part of his thigh done Hopefully you can see it. It's got a bottom. He has a little crook in his waist like he's kind of tilting over a little bit. Which is kind of cool. So now all I got to do is the lower legs and his arms. And then grow them all up and see what happens. But he's going to go with my bride of, uh, bride of Frankenstein. So we'll see from there. Bye.